What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So uh, since last time, a lot has changed. Let's start and welcome you guys to our brand new facility. Um, new to us, I should say, not new in general, but brand new facility to us. A lot of benefits from that, including the parking lot that we gain, which is awesome. We gain this whole shop here. We'll include some photos, uh, show you guys here a little bit. This place literally was the tenant before us was here for, I want to say, close to 20 years is what they're telling us. And it looked like it was 20 years old. So what did we do? We took care of this whole place, redid the whole thing, did the floors, did the shop, did the ceilings, black, new lighting, uh, pretty much everything here. So that's, for starters, that's one of the big things that's new since we've been back on the channel. I mean, we built this brand new Pro R that we'll show you guys here shortly. Uh, the little bit of the process. We didn't really have a bunch of time to film that build. We did film some stuff and we did build that car here at this new facility. We outsourced some things, of course. We're not cage builders and, and manufacturers for parts. So, of course, we had somebody else do those kinds of things. But as far as assembly, we assembled the cage here. Pretty much built the entire car here. Outsourced some of the wiring and that kind of thing and called on our partners to make that stuff happen. And we got a lot of cool parts from that build and that car has turned out awesome. Uh, we actually did win Camp Razor. Uh, we won three awards there, which was an honor. Uh, we've been fortunate enough to win multiple years in a row, but you know, every year we bring something new and, and wanted to bring this car. And it's been a couple years since we built a car of this caliber. So that's why we built this car. So I'm here to show you guys some stuff that's been going on in the shop and also tell you guys that we're back. So we have a lot of YouTube stuff planned that we're gonna be doing this season as well as pretty much through the shop and throughout the year from here forward is the plan. So with this new building, new facility, new parking lot, we're gonna have events, uh, get togethers, cars and coffee, that kind of thing. Also something else that is new, we got into the Tesla market. So we have a brand new 2022 Tesla that we had lowered, uh, wrapped, and we'll show you guys some of that stuff too. We haven't had a chance to do a walk around of that. Um, just so much stuff to cover, but we're happy to tell you guys that we're back on the channel and stay tuned because we're gonna be posting regularly on the channel um, and show you guys some stuff. But we also wanna hear your guys' input, so please comment down below. Uh, we'll show you guys some stuff on Instagram, follow us on all the channels, but please, we wanna hear what you guys wanna see and uh, you know we're gonna show creativity without giving all the secrets, but we're gonna be showing you know, kind of projects we have going on, some of the cool wraps we have going on, some of the events, going to Glamis, going to these you know, different locations to go riding. I mean, we're involved with so much stuff from it being off-road, on-road, I mean, you name it. So, and we do a lot of high-end cars too, some stuff that we can't show, unfortunately. But if you guys are not doing anything December 17th, definitely come out we're having a big toy drive a lot of cool people are going to be here and uh yeah i mean it's going to be awesome so definitely don't miss that if you guys aren't doing anything for december 17th so uh i guess uh we have some content really i mean that we haven't posted so collectively it's a lot of stuff to show um and we got bits and pieces little projects and so i'm just going to fast forward to that and i just want to show you guys get you guys up to speed on what we've done here and what we have been working on for the last couple of months not being on YouTube so we're gonna just highlight some things show you guys you know a mixture of some stuff projects that we've been doing and just fast forward through and uh, like I said we're here to tell you guys it's gonna be consistent and it's back on YouTube so we're back looking forward to it happy to be back and uh, just keep moving forward so let's start here and uh, just show you guys some video Tulips in a twist Hand up boss like communist No, I can never ever get back all the things I missed But on that man, they think you got the gist Got your tulips in a twist So we just finished this up, we do this customer's whole fleet uh, This vehicle is all white, so everything you see here is all printed uh, So this is full digital print uh, covering the roof 
back. And all the sides. First project done for the week. I'm gonna show you guys some more projects. That one's my boo. Cause if I'm bum 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 bum, if the lock ain't true, stay out of my face. Ain't no way you're winning this race. Look like a fool when you're trying to keep pace. You're the newest and a chance, keep it up anyway. Hey, 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 I'ma spare you the pain. Keep this memory out your brain. Can we leave this drama for a different day? Uh, got you tulips in a twist. And I boss like communist. No, I can never ever get back all the things. Someone's back here. If you guys don't know, you might recognize this car here. Mr. G Life. Straight out of work, we made it where all the cool kids live. So we're actually doing a full paint protection uh, film on this car. This car's painted, uh, so we want to protect all this stuff here, all this area uh, for rock chips. So we're doing our 10 year film that has paint protection properties, so it heals itself. It's magic. Different than vinyl. vinyl does protect the surface because you're putting a layer over the top, but it doesn't have self-healing properties. In the clear, PPF stuff does. So a little different film, different process. It's actually wet application versus dry. And it serves a completely different purpose. So we've been doing a lot of those cars because a lot of cars have been painted. So we want to offer film solutions for you guys. quick stuff of that so that hopefully you guys enjoyed that stuff but here to tell you too next we do have a video getting ready to get launched for our brand new pro art build we call chaos I'm walking over to it right now to show you guys if you guys haven't seen it there's some stuff here on this car that we've done on Instagram but a little sneak peek of the inside I mean we this car has pretty much has everything on it, then there's nothing missed. So uh, pretty proud of this car, especially showing that we won at Camp Razor. A lot of you guys felt the same way, which was awesome. This thing was so last minute, um, down to the wire to go to Camp Razor and stuff. So we literally finished that day at five in the morning. We worked through the night to get it done. And uh, it was awesome to get, you know, go out to Camp Razor and win those awards. And um, so you guys seemed to enjoy it, which is great. So more content for that. The next video will be this car showcasing what's on the car, what we did to it, how we did everything to it. And uh, you know, you guys can check that out. Any questions on that, feel free to comment down below, send us a DM, uh, email, any of that stuff. Um, yeah, like I said, that'll be the next video and we'll keep moving on from there. So thank you guys for tuning in to our channel and uh, thanks for all the support. We're trying to bring you guys quality content and wraps and graphics that are not out there. We were, you know, one of the first doing these style graphics on UTVs and it's hard to always come with new things, but we keep moving forward and, and keep coming up with new graphics and uh, you guys love them. So thank you again for all you guys' support and uh, we'll see you guys continuously on the channel. So thank you guys again. Peace.